Hey guys, welcome back. This is the second part of my Simply Gilded video. Um, this one is the boxes that I was talking about. So this is the June subscription box, and I managed to get the label off the front because they just slap a label on it. Because look how pretty this box is with all this foil, and it's pretty like all the way around. It's just really pretty. So I wanted to keep the box. I could store other things in it. Um, this is an older Simply Gilded subscription box um, called Iceland, which you can buy as a standalone box. I did that with the growth box from 2020. This is from 2021. Um, I don't know if there's really a difference um, between 2020 and 2021, but there is definitely a difference between those years and 2022. And I had said in this prior video that I had wanted to look at the difference, so we're going to do that. And then this is the summer box which is the whole reason I got the um, regular sub box because you got to buy this a day early to make sure you got it. I don't know if these are still available or not, but if they are, you can go on the website and check them out. As usual, I have a herd of elephants going over the top of my head. Um, so nothing in here has been unpackaged or swatched in any way, uh, unlike the prior video where I unpackaged everything and swatched it um, because I purposely wanted to look at the differences between the two boxes. So let's start with the older box, which is called Iceland. Um, and it's pretty, it's foiled, it's got a nice scene on the front. And then this is what comes in this box. So we've got vellum and acetate. We'll pull everything apart, don't worry. We've got sticker kit. We've got a stitched B6 notebook. We have like a knitted or crocheted pen pouch with a simply gilded heart charm on the zipper. We have the Jasper keychain type thing. I purchased him separately in a prior order, so now I have two of those. Um, oh, nice. See, there's there's a card and it tells you what's in here. So there's the foiled journaling card, which, ah, okay, so there's stuff in here. Designer washi, deluxe sticker kit and seals, cozy knit pouch, B6 stitched binding notebook, engraved gelling pen, stitched bear charm, uh, acetate and vellum sheets, and a mystery item absolutely no idea what the mystery item is. There's actually a spot on the website where I think it's this, I don't really know what this is yet, but it's this like stitched silver heart thing, I think. Okay, so this is the foiled journaling card, and it's the, looks like a postcard. You could actually mail these if you wanted to, but since I haven't been to Iceland, that seems mean to whoever I'm sending it to. Um, okay get everything out of this bag. Oh, okay, so my pen covering did not want to stay there. Alright, so this is a silver pen, it says Simply Gilded on here, which is the engraved part, and it's the regular pen, which is fine. It's silver, which is nice. Now what are you, I think this is just like, I don't even know what this is. Um, there's not two of them, there's just one of them. Um, it opens in the middle. I don't know why. Um, I have to go on the website and figure out what this is because I don't know. Um, but I find it interesting. So we'll see. Alright, so now we've got washi tape. Um, so let's see. Alright, so we've got you know, the same horizon as here with the bows. And then we've got penguins. And they look glittery. I think this is one of those thick glitter ones. I really wasn't going to open them all. We're going to have to swatch them later, so we'll figure it out, but that looks like one of those glitter ones. Um, and then this one's got scenes on it, like on the postcard, with some silver foil accents. So, I hope that's coming up. And then this is two different ones, so this is silver foil with white stars on it, and then this one is like days of the week with a pink heart on black washi, which is cool and, you know, functional. Um, and then there is this washi, which looks like the um, pen bag. And then this washi is just the smaller version of this one. They're the same, just two different sizes, just like in that growth box. Um, so that's that the bear charm, which actually you guys have already seen. Um, there is this bag. Which 
I can't seem to get open. Okay, so this actually makes it like quite heavy on one side. Um, so it does say simply gild it on both sides. It unzips, it's lined inside, so it's not like this material inside, but this is like really soft. It's like you took your sweater and, and made a pencil bag. That's a really cute stray string there. But until you put things in it, this weighs down on like the one side. Okay. And then this is the little B6 notebook. We've seen these before. It's either plain or dark red paper, but it's got that pretty horizon and this star symbol that appears on the washi as well. Him on the back. Garbage. Okay, so this is the vellum and acetate. This is pretty vellum. It's like that background. It's got the foiled stars on it. And it does say simply gilded over there. And okay, so there's no acetate in here. It's just vellum. So, and this is the vellum that looks like the crocheted pen bag. Okay. And then there's the sticker kit and seals, which opens over here. Okay, so we've got a sheet of date dots with that pretty ombre like horizon color and then these little icon stickers and these things called seals I actually came up with a use for these I just haven't put it to use yet um, but they're I think too big for me to stick on a page really maybe not but I think they probably are okay so then we've got full boxes and then these little headers or borders down here and this is all silver foil and then we've got bow checklists couple of words up top, family, work, gratitude, and then like a Monday through Sunday, a bunch of boxes, more boxes, and a bunch of headers or dividers or whatever you want to use them for. And then we've got tons of flag checklists and decorative flags, decorative stickers, bows, and more useful icons and hearts down here. And then you've got four sets of day covers, a couple more boxes, this one says gratitude, and then that list of like meeting, appointment, important goal, shopping list, meal plan, to clean and to do. So that's everything that comes in this box. Does this thing tell me when? Okay, so this is from November 2021. So you've got the sticker kit, this bonus thing, the postcard, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rolls of washi the vellum, the book, the pen bag, and the bear charm, and the pen. So I don't know what it was when it was a sub box. I don't know how much it cost. Oh, and the menu card. I have absolutely no idea what this cost when it was a sub box because I wasn't a subscriber or like I was shopping, but I wasn't paying attention to the sub box. Um, so this is, it. you know, it told me November 2021 right there. I didn't have to look at the packing list. Okay, so this is what comes, what came in the prior boxes. So now we're going to look at my new sub box. My box is still pretty, but for starters, the box is smaller. Well, all right, let's put the top in to be fair, right? box is a little bit bigger here and bigger here. Oh, not that much, but still bigger. Okay. Now, this one comes with a pretty journaling card that you could use as a postcard on the front, well, on the top, and then it's got this stuff. All right, and then we've got a pretty foiled box, which I assume is washi. We've got the pen. And a sticker kit. Okay, so that's everything that's in here. So this, hold on. Okay, so we've got our card. Definitely better packaging for the pens, I think. Or this one just enjoys being in its plastic. I don't know. So this is that pretty beachy, like tie-dye ombre color. 
and it's just the regular pen. And then this is the hollow silver foil on here. And there's hollow silver foil on the box, which is cute. Okay, so we've got this white one with this like pearlescent bubble overlay, and it's supposed to look like waves. So that's cute. And then we've got more. Um, does it match that? I don't know. I mean, the colors match the kit, but I don't. There's nothing jumping out at me that has this particular ombre pattern. So that's the bow washi. It's all silver holographic foil. And then this one looks like um, hearts and maybe some palm trees, some watermelon and stuff like that. And then it's got silver hollow hearts on it. And this one is like a beach scene with the foil accents. That's cute. And then this one is two rolls. So there's this um, palm trees and bow washi on, I don't know what kind of background that is. It kind of looks just like it's just pink. Uh, maybe there's like a stripe in there that I'm not seeing. And then there's the same color and the silver hollow foil combined in the smaller roll. And then there is the smaller version of the bow washi. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rolls of washi. So the same seven rolls of washi, card, pen, and a sticker kit. So let's see, maybe the sticker kit's different. I don't know. So I didn't open anything on purpose. Even though I really wanted to, I didn't. I waited. Okay. So here's our date dots with this kind of tie-dye, sherberty background for this beach chic box. And then we've got a decorative sticker sheet, which did not come in the sticker kit for the prior box. And we've got full boxes and little headers or dividers all on this nice silver hollow, all in these nice summery pastel colors. We've got bow checklists, headers, Monday through Sunday, some boxes, more strips. This is kind of like the glitter strips in the DEK kits in case anyone's trying to figure out like what they are. It, it's pretty much like that. They're just like patterned with different things. Um, this one does have like glitter type stuff all over it. And then this is the one with all the checklists and flags and more decorative stickers, hearts with useful icons, and then this whole thing of like 12 bows over here. And then you've got four sets of day covers, a couple of to-dos, and then, wow. Okay, these are really, let's see if I can get it where you can see them. This is like super tiny script, like super tiny. And it's the usual words they put there, but wow, that is like super small print. Um, and all the day covers are in silver holographic foil and like this small scripty font, but not as small as that. And then you've got the four other boxes, and there seems to always be one that says gratitude. Um, okay, so the current sub box is a sticker kit, postcard, seven rolls of washi, and a pen, and costs $30. The old box. I don't know what it cost when it was a sub box, but I purchased it for 40 bucks. And in addition to all of these things, it came with uh, the bear charm, the pen case, the weird silver heart thing that we don't really know what that is, and the B6 book, and the vellum. So I'm not really sure. Okay. So here's this sub box. And not knock these things over. And here's the old sub box. Mind you, I don't know what the old sub box cost. I don't know if there were other things in it that I did not get in the box I purchased, but I don't know. So I'm just going by what, you know, they sold me. Um, it's 
not really enough room to put all of it here. Um, so 2021, November, June 2022. Oh, and the pen. So if you used to subscribe to the old box, I'd love to know if it was $40 um, because I would totally spend $40 on a loaded box like that. This one at 30 bucks, I'm having a little trouble with, but I'll probably stick around for another month and see what they do. I tried to get Irene to say what the July box was going to be on uh, her Instagram live today, and that didn't work. She like totally ignored my question, so um, I'm guessing she doesn't want to tell anybody yet. But this is what came in these boxes. So, like this is, you know, an older box. I don't mind buying older stuff if I like the stuff, and I do. Um, so this one was called Iceland. I don't know if they're still on the site. I imagine they are. The growth box was still on the site. Um, but I can't promise because I don't know. Um, Alright, and there's that washi. And then this stuff. Oh, I have to deal with those paper shreds. Okay, how about... Let me just move some things around here real quick. So, I don't know, I'm thinking the older boxes were the better deal, but it depends on what they cost, and I don't know. So, this is the new thing, and this is, um, like, a seasonal box, um, which you don't subscribe to. It's an individual purchase, and if you're a sub-box subscriber, you have to buy it a day early to make sure you could get it. Um, the day after, so this was available on the 7th, which I ordered this, I ordered the Iceland box, I ordered the pen refills I showed in the last video, and I ordered the, um... Pride washi set in that order, this order, um, and then the regular sub box came separately. So I waited for everything to get here. So this is the inside of the summer box. Like the outside is totally plain Jane white, um, <laughs> and then you open it up and it's got like this colored background and the silver hollow foil and it's super pretty. Okay, so we've got a little bow sticker with silver hollow foil. We've got a sampler number seventy three, which I think. Did the last one? Did the sub box come with a sampler? I don't think it did. I don't remember, but I don't think so. But this matches that, like, perfect. Um, so we've got a foil journaling card with silver hollow foil and that pastel background, and it's blank on the back. Then we've got another sampler. This one is 61. It's got sushi on it. And then there's a foil journaling card with a lot of yellow that says, Here Comes the Sun. Uh, and we've got more of this blue stuff. Okay. Um, all right. So we've got another pen that's kind of got these summery, sherberty colors on it. Are they the same pen? They are not the same pen, even though they could be mistaken for the same pen. They are not. This one has more like pink and purple and blue in it. Um, or they are the same pen and they're just wrapped differently. Like the colors wrapped on differently. I'm not. Like that's an exact match pretty much, except for the top of this pen. So I don't know. But they're very similar. This one came from here. <laughs> and this one came from here. Okay. Uh yeah, blue stuff. Um, okay, so we've got an album. And charm for the album and the scrunchie. And we've got washi tapes. stitched notebook and a vellum and acetate and a desktop notepad all right so this is the summer box summer theme box seasonal box summer and this cost forty dollars okay <laughs> all right what do I want to open first well, this is just cool. This is like a big scrunchie, and it's got like the summery tie-dyed um, colors. And if I remember correctly, Irene said you can actually just untie this bow. It's just tied around it. I could be wrong. I feel like that's what she said in the live. And then it's got the little tag on it too. So that's cute. I like that. I did not see this available for individual purchase in case anyone was curious. Um, and then this is the charm for the, or the bow charm 
for the album so it's got kind of these light pastel colors in it too and then this is the album and is it a large album? I think this is the large album let's get that off of it got silver hardware and then it's got kind of sort of tie-dyed sort of not all these like sherberty um, summery colors and it's blue inside yeah I think this is a large album and then it's got <clears throat> excuse me simply gilded stamped in the back little scalped pocket in the front so this is pretty cool can't get enough albums also have to get them to snap closed okay so this goes with this we looked at the pen okay so this appears to be a little b6 stitch notebook I'm never putting it back in it anyway. Okay, so this has silver hollow foil all over the outside, and it is super cute. And it has blank pages inside. Well, that's weird. Oh well. It's still cute. And then this, I believe, is vellum and acetate. Okay, so we've got silver holographic palm trees on clear acetate, and then we've got kind of the tie-dyed sherberty colored vellum, and then we've got more of a, I think Irene refers to this as watermelon whenever she has like pink and green together uh, vellum. So we got those, and we've got this. is a weekly notepad so it's got silver foil and you can put the date here and it says the week okay I would have gone with this week but all right and then it's got like vertical columns for every day of the week there's a longer one for Saturday oh there is not one here for Sunday oh yes there is all right we do have to take this band off it I wasn't going to but we have to So Saturday and Sunday are over here and they're just smaller and it's got the foil and then you've got a box with a list for top goals and there's three of them with hearts as checklists to do same thing three with hearts or checklists and then a notes page and then the other side is blank and there's a good number of pages in here for this so that's pretty neat um, you know if you like want something like that for your desktop or to pre-plan like a week before you get to it in your planner or something like that um, you could fill one of these out and then um, glue it into like an art journal of journal pretty sure this would fit in a journal yeah definitely would fit in a journal so that's pretty cool so the only thing that this is missing from the prior uh, sub boxes I think is a sticker kit Like, I'm guessing this would be your mystery item. So, I don't know. But this was $40, so that's a strange coincidence. Okay, so what have we got here? We've got pigeons or seagulls. Seagulls. And hearts on a light blue background. And this one is a scallop cutout, like, ombre of all these pastel colors. I don't know if you can see that. So it's, like, scalloped on the bottom, and then it's got heart cutouts. And then this one is definitely like, I saw this and I was like, oh, it's go wild washi. This is exactly what it looks like to me. Um, the colors might be slightly different. Um, but this might be silver hollow foil, but honestly, this looks like purple foil. This is purple foil. So I know this will be individually for sale um, on Friday. Because she told us that in the live. Okay, 
so that's everything in the summer box like this is supposed to be in there this is supposed to be in there this is from two other boxes like this is from the sushi set and this is from I think last month's um, sub box or two months ago maybe I'm not sure um, so I think these were just thrown in as freebies just like with that O sticker um, so yeah so forty dollars forty dollars for the old sub box thirty dollars for the new sub box which is like extremely slimmed down in comparison uh, I love this stuff I'm just not sure how I feel about that I think I would like it better if they went back to the old sub box um, but I, I don't know why they changed it maybe it's supply chain issues maybe it's I don't, I don't know I have no idea um, okay so I'm going to cut the video swatch the washi oh dear which tried to run away from me because uh, we have like three sets here and then uh, I'll be back and we'll check it out okay I'm back so I started with the summer seasonal box which is these three and I was right this is purple foil so that is awesome um, so we left off at the pride washi in the last video so here's the summer box washies this is incredibly difficult to rip um, I suggest scissors for that ripping it is not as you can see great um, okay so that's the summer box and then we have the June sub box and I was right that is a pink and white stripe I didn't think I was right but it turns out I am in fact correct So there's those, and they are very pretty. I really love that wave one. And this is a cute little, cute little beach scene. Okay, and then we've got our November 2021 Iceland sub box washi. And this top one is like the answer to what if Bob Ross came back from the dead and made washi tape? Because really, that looks like a Bob Ross painting with a foiled star. This is, in fact, glitter. I don't know how well it's going to come up on camera, but this is a glitter one. These are perforated, so these are like little dividers or headers or whatever you want to use them for. And then these are also perforated. These are those functional days of the week. This is the one that looks like the pencil case. And then this is the ombre bow washi. And then that's the larger one. And that is all of the washi from these boxes. So I'm up to 76 rolls of Simply Gilded Washi, and I, I have an order that they printed my shipping label, and it should be shipping any day now, and then, um, because they had a, a pre-sale extras and restocks, um, sale. So that should be leaving their warehouse tomorrow or the next day, and then Friday is another summer sale. So, yeah, we're going to be past 100 rolls of Washi, probably. Um, which is why I left a lot of space for Simply Gilded. <laughs> because I really love their washi. And this does not include the two rolls that I have that they made for Wild University. Because I have not opened those and I don't think I'm going to for a while. They're just going to stay neatly packaged. So we are now on to this set of pages. I got sick of writing in pink, so now we're writing in purple. Um, so yeah, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, share it with a couple of your friends. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already so that you don't miss any more videos. And I'll see you in the next one.